नमस्कार आई अमित कुमार वेलकम यू ऑल इन आई एम डीज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग सो एज यू कैन सी ऑन योर स्क्रीन दैट टुडे आइसोलेटेड कोल्ड वेव कंडीशन हैव बीन रिकॉर्डेड ओवर सम पॉकेट्स ऑफ मध्य महाराष्ट्र If we talk about fog conditions then dense fog was observed over isolated pockets of Uttar Pradesh on your screen you can see the station wise visibility now if we talk about the deep depression which is present over so- southwest bay of bengal then during na- last 6 hours it has moved with a speed of 8 km per hour in north northwest direction and it is likely to intensify into a cyclonic storm during next 6 hours tomorrow that is on 30th November by afternoon it is likely to cross between Karaikal and Mahabalipuram as a cyclonic storm. So under the influence of this uh, system heavy to very heavy rainfall with isolated extremely heavy rainfall is likely over Tamil Nadu and Rail Seema on 29th and 30th of November and over south coastal Andhra Pradesh on 30th of November. Now if we talk about, uh, about other synoptic systems then the western disturbance is currently lying uh, at around 54 degree east and 32 degree north the yesterday's cyclonic circulation over south bangladesh still persists and the jet, jet stream winds are still prevailing over northwest india with a speed of 130 knots on your screen you can see the minimum temperature and minimum temperature departure maps so in this map you can clearly see that uh, cold wave conditions are recorded over Madhya Maharashtra. Now if you talk about day one that is 29th of November warnings then as we have already informed you that uh, extremely heavy rainfall is likely over Tamil Nadu and Rail Seema today and uh, very heavy rainfall is very likely over south districts of coastal Andhra Pradesh. Then under the influence of this system as the, it will be crossing uh, tomorrow afternoon uh, Tamil Nadu coast then extremely heavy rainfall red color warnings are issued for Tamil Nadu, Rail Seema and South Andhra Pradesh as it can be seen on your screen and very heavy rainfall is issued for uh, SIK that is South Interior Karnataka and Kerala. On 1st of December uh, for Tamil Nadu, SIK and Kerala very heavy rainfall with orange color warning is issued and for Rail Seema and South uh, Coastal Andhra Pradesh heavy rainfall warning in yellow color is issued. On 2nd of December uh, very heavy rainfall is likely to continue over South Interior Karnataka and Kerala and heavy rainfall is likely to continue over Tamil Nadu and Lakshadweep. On 3rd of December, heavy rainfall is likely to continue over Lakshadweep, Kerala, Tamil Nadu and CK. Under the influence of this system, even thunderstorm activity is likely to continue till 3rd of December over peninsular India. Now if you talk about other warnings, then you can see that for today cold wave warning is issued for Madhya Maharashtra and dense fog warning is issued for next 3 days for Uttar Pradesh. If we talk about fisherman warning then as you can see on your screen that as this system deep depression is likely to intensify into a cyclonic storm then so gale wind warning of wind speed ranging from 60 to 80 kmph and gusting to 90 kmph is issued for southwest bay of bengal for next two days then subsequently for third day squally winds with the wind speed of 45 to 55 kmph and gusting to 65 kmph is issued and for remaining two days that is fourth and fifth uh, day that is second december and third december squally weather is likely to prevail over kerala and adjoining Comrin areas so all fishermen brothers are requested not to venture into deep sea over in these areas over southwest bay of bengal Comrin area and kerala coast you can join us on our mosum website and mosum app and on also on our various social media handles where you will be updated with latest weather information namaskar Jai.